Oh good, the soap arrived. It's Friday, welcome to the vlog. Guess who got home and why? Yay, I passed my exam! Yay! <laughs> We've been talking about it for a while. Meg had her second and final exam to be a licensed clinical social worker, and she passed. Woo! This is so exciting. It's our first mail time. <laughs> mail time, mail time. Everybody get your mail time. Nobody sent us this. We ordered it. Shampoo? Body wash. Body wash? Right? I don't know. And some soap. Don't forget the conditioner. Oh, and conditioner too. Oh no, it exploded. Because you just popped it. No, this is this one. All right, we have jumped all the way into the evening. It is 5.16 right now. I am on my way to uh, to the one woman show gig at Diversionary. Um, I played there, I think I mentioned a few months ago, I did a run of a world premiere musical called The Boy Who Danced On Air. It was super fun and I really like playing there. It's a nice, small, intimate space. Anyway, I'm heading there now in the, the beautiful part. I think it's the closest theater to my house. It's, uh, oh sure, after you guys. It's, it's actually, it's right across the street from my old apartment when I lived with Uncle Dave, Davey Rocket. It's just like a mile, maybe a mile and a quarter west of where Meg and I live currently. Um, I suppose there is technically a theater closer um, down the street a little bit, but they, uh, I think SDMT was working out of there for a season or two, but there's no shows going on anymore there. It's just like, it's like rock shows and band concerts. They're not doing theater there any longer. Anyway, ramble, ramble, ramble. I'm excited to go play the show. It's gonna be fun. I'm hot and sweaty because I had to load up my car and everything, and I'm wearing three fourths of my blacks. I'll put a nice shirt on uh, afterwards and possibly change my shoes or into nicer pants. Right now I'm wearing black jeans. They're nice, but you know, might want to put slacks on or something. Anyway, looking forward to uh, to playing tonight. It'll be fun. Got to get some time to uh, warm up my hands. I played a little bit for like 15 minutes earlier today, but. Um, Definitely not going to be enough, but thankfully we're there for a long time before we even start, so I'll have plenty of time to have my hands on the instrument, and we're going to run a few, few tunes, so life is good. It's all bueno. Under the pain and sky, moon in your hair had caught my eye, all that I planned to say. Swept away, you turned your face to mine. Beat of my heart is keeping time. I finally leave my head and say, We're here trying to finish getting everything set up. It's been kind of crazy, and my lens looks really dirty. Okay, I am back home now. I forget if I said how crazy it was uh, leading up to the show there. It was... Uh, let's. I'm not sure I've ever been in a professional gig that was that crazy down to the wire and thought it might get cancelled. Not gonna throw anyone under the bus. It was nobody's fault in particular. It was just a bunch of crazy situations and I mean up until nine minutes before we were supposed to start playing, it was possible that we were gonna cancel. I mean, it was nuts, it was absolutely crazy. Anyway, we ended up getting everything worked out. I keep saying we. Not throwing anyone under the bus, but I will say that it wasn't the musician's or the actor's fault. <laughs> anyway, it all came together. It ended up being a really, really rad show. It was great. It's so much fun. I forgot a lot of the content of the show. You know, I obviously remembered the music, especially after the rehearsal the other night, but I forgot the story and the banter and the and the, the patter uh, between, between all of the tunes. And it's really fun. It's a fun show. I'm excited that we have a second night of it this time around. The last time I did it, you know, a year and a half ago, we only had one night. So I'm excited that we get to do it again tomorrow. So that means it'll be even more polished, stuff will come together, and, and it's just, it's fun. 
So anyway, uh, picked up some food on the way home. Meg went out with her friend Meredith to celebrate Meg passing the test today. So I brought some food home for Meg and myself. And uh, now just kind of kicking back, relaxing for a few minutes. And uh, going to get to bed early. I have to be in OB at 10. Um, so that means I need to do some editing tonight. F you know, finish editing and posting the vlog tomorrow. And uh, got a show at 11. We're getting there at 10 to do some run-throughs and stuff. Another show at 2, and then I have a few hours off, and then back to Diversionary for uh, for the second uh, Julie gig. It's gonna be a fun day though, filled with music. I love it. I haven't had a day where it's like boom, boom, boom like that in a while. So, looking forward to it. Lots of cool stuff going on. I hope you guys had an amazing day. I hope tomorrow's even better, and I'll see you tomorrow. I wanna know you more. I've never felt this way before.